I'm Juan, it's Jody. back here with Strength and Wisdom Tarot, here to do a random reading for March 13th. Now keep in mind that they are general readings, so take what applies, if it applies, you know what to do with the rest. Thank you for everyone who has liked, subscribed, and shared, you guys rock. And if anyone would like a personal reading with me, all that info will be in the box below. So let's see what's shaking for the 13th of March. Ooh. We have the page of pentacles, a messenger of the see, hear, taste, touch, prove. Ooh. Then we get the six of wands. That's victory, overcoming a battle and being victorious. And then we have the king of pentacles. Hmm. You start off with the page, you get some sort of success, and then it turns you into a king. Could be money. Something comes in and, yeah, because look, something's being rectified, something's being justified, something's being made fair. Hmm. Could have won a court case. That's why I'm feeling victorious. Could have been money involved with it. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. We have the Eight of Cups, but in the reverse. In the upright, that would be the emotionally walking away from the situation because it's not fulfilling. And then you get the Tower. And that's right under the Pentacles. But the Tower is in reverse, too. So somebody is avoiding a disaster. Or avoided a disaster. Because they didn't walk away from something. They stuck to something and made it right. That's what makes them rich. So far. I think the Six of Wands here is somebody that did the right thing. We have the Holy Grail of Love. The universe giving this cup to see if you take it or not. And then you have the truth. The truth right under the King of Pentacles. A truth of clarity was known. Somebody might be loving this victory. It could be a sweet victory. Oh. Nah. That wasn't a real shuffle. I think somebody's life just turned around because they didn't, they chose not to bow out of something. Now you have the chariot. That's moving forward with success. Again, another card of victory. Oh. And now you have the Knight of Cups. Cups being of the suit, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Or more so just a messenger of something that is heartfelt, something that's sentimental. So let's get into it. Bottom of the deck. We have the King of Wands. Now here's your Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or somebody who takes on these properties. They're passionate. They're motivated. They go get it done. They're creative. If this is not a person that's in the dynamics of this, then somebody who is passionate, creative, and motivated to see something all the way to the end. Hmm. So, folks, we're going to start off with the page of Pentacles. Here's a message of a see, hear, taste, touch, prove thing. Material thing. And then you have the Six of Wands, which is victory. Overcoming a battle, coming back from a battle, and being victorious. Being recognized. And then, like I said, you go from a uh, page to a king. And this is, you know, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or somebody who takes on these properties. This is somebody who's well-grounded, a realist, a practical, methodical. They like to have their material things. And the King of Pentacles is looking right at the Justice card. Also known as a Libra card, but this is um, making something fair, something being justified, rectified. If it's not in a 
judicial, you know, nature, this could be karma. Karmic justice coming here and setting something right. Because somebody chose not to walk away with the Eight of Cups. And by not walking away, they avoided a disaster. The tower in reverse. And by doing this, knowing that this is the right thing to do by this person, it brings on an opportunity for a new love, maybe a renewal of a relationship. Somebody speaks the truth. I think the truth is part of the victory here. And this person, or perhaps people, can go forward, move forward, and have that victory and have that success. And to be able to express that with the King of Cups. Wow. So, let's break it down. So, folks, something gets offered in order to avoid a disaster. I think this person knew it was the right thing to do in their heart. And it makes them feel victorious. Possible earth sign or somebody who has these properties stuck to their truth. Spoke their truth. A clear communication which was fair, just, and move somebody forward. Because they didn't give up. They held in there. So, folks, that is what I have for you. Please keep on liking, subscribing, and sharing my channel. And I'll see everybody back here real soon. Take care.